This quick look demonstration focuses on the new project and program management option made available to TeamCenter Express users in version 4. These proven capabilities from the TeamCenter portfolio enable project managers to create new project schedules from templates, link documents that are managed by TeamCenter Express as deliverables for specific tasks, link TeamCenter Express workflows to project tasks, and view the status of multiple projects and programs. In our home area in TeamCenter Express, we first create a new folder. We select the folder and then the command to create a new project schedule. A wizard guides us through the steps to create the new schedule. Here we are specifying the schedule name and a project number for this schedule. We specify that we want to use a template to create this new project schedule and we select for one from a list of pre-configured templates that are delivered with TeamCenter Express. In the next step in the project schedule wizard we add a description for this schedule. Finally, we specify some options for the new schedule, for example, that it is to be visible to other users and that it has the notification option enabled. We also specify the start date for this schedule. We can see the new schedule linked to the folder. We send the schedule to the schedule manager application so we can view and modify the schedule. We close the navigation panel so we have more screen area to work with our new schedule. We use the expand all command so we can see all the tasks and milestones in this schedule. We also expand the columns so we can see the schedule task descriptions. We can also change the time scale to show calendar quarters instead of months to get a higher level perspective of the schedule. We now select a schedule task so we can examine and edit its properties. In this example, we change the name and description for the selected schedule task from those that were assigned from the schedule template. Note some of the other properties we can edit here, for example the start date and duration of a scheduled task. We will now link a TeamCenter Express workflow to the selected scheduled task. In this example we specify that the trigger for the workflow is either the scheduled start date or when the predecessor tasks are complete, but note that other options are available for this trigger. We also specify the type of TeamCenter Express workflow that will be triggered. In this case, we will trigger the pre-configured development release workflow. Note that the schedule task icon has changed to indicate that a workflow is now linked to this task. We now start the schedule by starting the first schedule task. Again, the icon is changed to help communicate the status of the schedule to the user. In this case, showing that the schedule is now in process. We now go back to My Team Center and display the navigation pane. We display our work list and see that we have a new workflow task to perform that has been triggered from our new project schedule. This demonstrates the tight integration between the schedule manager and the TeamStar Express workflow capability.